Hi, Hello. Ken. Oh. How great to see you. Good to see you. Well, if you won't come to Scotland, Scotland's got to come to you. I'm glad you do. So how long have you been here, Ken? Since September. Um, what is it actually like to audit here as opposed to flag? Oh, it's completely different. It's a completely different world. Uh, I don't have to think about my well-done auditing hours because I'm not being chased by tax services, by the DFP, by the pages, by the tech sec. I'm not being chased by the chief officer and the CEO isn't on my tail, not to mention messengers and communicators and God knows what. So uh, I just take a PC into session and my concentration is on helping the PC get the most wins we can get out of the session for the PC and to make sure he gets those wins. And I'm not worried if some situation comes up in the session, I know I can handle it and handle it in a fairly relaxed manner. Whereas if some situation came up at flag where you're, you're in session with the PC and you're not totally sure what's going on, your first thought is, my God, I'm going to get a cram. And that means less well done auditing hours, which means the CEO and everybody else down the line is going to be on your tail. And um, one other thing, Ken, is did you have any uh, considerations about uh, working outside the, stru the structure of the org? Before? Uh, well, I must say that uh, for the last about the year before I left, I'd been seriously thinking about what I would do the rest of my life because I didn't think that uh, staying in the CO would be the best thing on all dynamics. But uh, I had never ever at any time thought of auditing outside flag or outside the organization without, uh, without permission. I had considered that during my leave that I was working on getting, I might have to work to make the money to, to pay my fare. And I had asked for permission to audit during that time and was given it. I later decided I wouldn't do it. But uh, no, I had not thought of auditing outside the organization. Right. Well, I'm glad you changed your mind. Me too. I've been very happy doing it. And would you like to um, pass on a message to the many, many, many people you must know around the world, Scientologists? Well, I'd like to say that um, I'll be glad to hear from anybody who knows me or remembers me. I, if there's anything I can do for anybody, I'd be glad to do it. If there's any uh, communication anybody wants to send me, I'd be glad to receive it. If there's any, if anything out on the line, I'd even happier to hear about it and do what I can to re-establish a good communication line. Great. And how about you visit Scotland again? Oh, I'll be doing that for sure. Thanks yeah. very much, Ken.